In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create 2022 New Year slide in PowerPoint. And this is how the slide works. When I click, you can see here I have added this kind of typography. I've put 2022 in different color formats. And then you can add your text here, Happy New Year. And when I click, the fireworks will come. So you can see here now. So you can add some different color fireworks to your slide. If you have not subscribed to my channel PowerPoint University, please subscribe it now and make sure to enable the bell notification icon. You can join my Telegram group with the help of this link. And if you like to contribute to my channel, you can do it through PayPal or Patreon. The link is provided in the video description section. I have used Office 2019 version to do this. However, with the older version also, it is possible to do. So let's start the tutorial. Add a new slide and change the background to any color background. For that, right mouse click, go to format background and select any color of your choice i'm going to choose this one which is the blue color and then go to insert text box i'm going to type 2 and change the font color to white and font i'm going to change to arial black and i'm going to make the size is almost 200 so something like this it will look and then i'm going to change the settings i'm going to give some 3d format for that so you can see here there are two options available under format shape shape options and text options so we are dealing with the text so we need to click on the text options and then you need to go to the this one which is the text effects and under text effects you can go to the 3d rotation and i'm going to choose from perspective this one which is you can see here this particular thing which is perspective contrasting right just click that one and then i'm going to change the settings of this xyz rotation so for this x rotation i'm going to put something 304.7 or with the help of this also you can change it you can see with the help of this arrow also so and the y rotation i'm going to make it as 330 so you can see here i can just change the moment i'm changing this also gets changed so i'm just changing it manually so i'm going to make it 330.9 you can see here and then the z rotation i'm going to make it as 26.9 and the perspective let it be 45 degrees all right so i'm just going to duplicate this by pressing ctrl d you can see here let it be like this here and this one i'm going to change the color to some other color so i'm going to the font color and maybe i'm going to choose this color you can see here the red color and go to again the text options text effects under 3d format i'm going to make the depth as almost 600 points you can see here it looks something like this all right i'm just going to put it here and then you can see here the lighting i'm going to select this one and material i'm going to choose this one so we got some lighting effect here if you want to give some different effect also like this also you can give so let it be this one which is the metal and then this one i'm going to paste it at the top let me just bring this to front you can see here so it looks something like this exactly you need to put it on top of this all right so this is the 2000 now i'm going to make similar for zero also so duplicate this one i'm going to make this as zero again duplicate this for our future use now using the format painter i'm just going to copy the properties to this one so let me just move this to a little bit i'm going to select this to the one this one and then uh, under home you got the format painter click on the format painter and click on this so you can see here you have end up getting a shape like this and then this color i'm going to change to orange all right and then you can put it here and then i'm going to make it something like this and then i need uh, two more uh, tools to be copied so for 2022 so let me just put it again back here and then i'm going to copy and paste two times this one so let me just select this part only the second one press ctrl d and here again press ctrl d one more time and then i'm going to give some different color for this i'm going to give uh, maybe a kind of blue color and for this 
I'm going to give uh, say a green color all right and then I'm going to put this back here so now let's uh, arrange this one in the right sequence so I'm just going to select both of these we can see here and move this one here at the back and then go to format just send this to back all right so you can see here 2000 and then I'm going to select these two and then I'm going to bring it here all right and then this also I'm going to select and I'm going to put it here and send this to back so something like this okay so whichever way you want you can put it now if I put on the slideshow it looks something like this so again if you want to change the direction I'm going to select all if you want to make it somewhat up I'm going to pull it somewhat up here you can see here in this case this is visible so you need to uh, just increase the depth of this one again you need to go here and you need to increase to maybe 650 so that it will not be visible even maybe 700 I need to do you can see here it looks something like this so depending on your requirement how much depth you need you can change it again if you want to arrange again you can just select this okay and then you can arrange properly also you can see here I'm just moving this one and I want this one to be more closer here something like this and this one I want to be more closer here and this again I'm going to move a little bit here and this one should come here all right so again I'm going to put this back and this one you can see here it looks more clear and then you can just play it so once this is done what you can do is you can go to insert text box and you can type happy new year or any other message also you can type it here and then I'm going to make it white maybe the font I'm going to use open sans and increase the size and put it here now it's very easy to do some animations I'm going to select all of this you can see here let me just select from the bottom and then close this one go to the animations enable the animation pane add animation I'm going to select fly in fly in I want the direction should come from the bottom left so it comes something like this and then depending on your requirement how you want this to come at once example if I click it comes something like this and right and then for this you can add a different animation again maybe fly in again maybe fly in you can say from left and then double click this one and you can do it all animate text all at once or by letter also whichever way and timings you can make it very fast or more faster that one maybe 0 0.3 and click ok so it comes something like this and this should happen after previous so if I play now so you can see here it comes something like this or if you want to do it one by one also you can just change the settings here you can make it after previous or you can some uh, delay add some delay also and once this is done you can add some fireworks so here I have created some uh, freeform shape with the help of this one you can go to insert shapes and with the help of this freeform shape you can create a shape something like that and this is some time consuming job so you can just simply copy and paste so I can just select like this you can see here control C and paste it here so and then add animations I have added here and then if I put it comes something like this you can see here so uh, you can just change the direction how you want uh, everything all this is editable if you want to change the color of this you can go to color and give some different color here you can see here I can give some maybe more darker color if you want so depending on your requirement you can just change this one